Cool. Uh, it'll load eventually. Okay. Fucking boom. Alright. This is three. Let's go. Pop album video game? You mentioned it before. You've, uh, you've been telling me, like, not to play it. I should have a beer already, actually. Now yeah, I'll save it. I'll save it for either Valhalla or One Piece. Tuck, we've arrived at B2. Ugh. Tuck. Ah. Uh, thank goodness. We there yet? Yes, but... Now let's get moving. No way. You're not ready. You're still bleeding. Oh, buy it. It's your point if you want to uh, buy the game or not. Uh, blood? I mean, right now I have no plans to play it because I, I already have a few games that I need to play. I need to finish. Mm -hmm. This ain't no biggie to me. No, your wounds aren't fully healed. It could be fatal if they're open up. If, if they open up. I said it's no big deal. No. Huh? Ray. What's... wrong with your face? It's okay. It's okay. It's alright. He's just passed out. He's still alive. But carrying him any further is just not in the cards. I can't very well stand him up and make him walk. Not to mention the blood. Just, just stitches won't cut it. I gotta stop the bleeding and disinfect his wounds. I'll go check if there's any medicine somewhere on this floor. I got a message. Why did I get a message? Uh, oh, uh, it's just Discord, okay. Yep, nothing to really see here. Okay, Zuck, hang in there for a bit. I promise to make myself useful. So just hang in... So just hang tight until then. I gotta hurry. Hey Ma from Tattletail? Yeah. Same. <laughs> it sounds like a pipe organ. <laughs> the lights came on. This place gives me a weird vibe. What? Smoke coming from an overturned candle. The smoke, it sort of has a sweet scent. What just happened? I spaced out for a second. No, enough about that. I gotta hurry up and find Zack's medicine. God desires the pure of and sincere. Hence I inquire, what art thou? A sacrifice? An angel? Of death? Or if thou art someone who seekest 
salvation from him. Reveal all and repent. Repent? Is that a confessional in front of me? So this place is salvation. Let me save. There's a door, but it's closed. Never mind, okay. There's a door. Okay, bid thy name is written on the door center. I guess it needs my name here. You should have brought the fucking... Rachel Gardner. It opened. Makes sense. Being a confessional and all. I hope there's some medicine in there. Why would there be medicine in a confessional? Here I go. Is it just me or... Is the sweet scent getting stronger? Maybe my mind's playing tricks on me. There's no way out. Oh no. But Zach's counting on me to find medicine for him. I gotta find the way out. Small vial lies atop, atop a chair. Acquired vial. The inside. It's empty. I suppose, I suppose this is an ink vial. There's writing on the wall. Profess thy sins. Let a vial serve as testament. Then, what dost thou feel upon reflection? A door to perceive thy defilement hath been opened. Uh, I just heard something unlock. Hmm. What does it mean by professing my sins onto this vial? Oh, wait. I didn't... I did not think I could actually walk in here. What if I go to the other door then? Oh. They, they're both unlocked. Um, she looked that way, so that's probably the right way. I mean, to be fair, you probably have to walk into... Both of them anyway. There's nothing but a mirror here. Look well into thyself. Art thou a sacrifice or the lost? Or are you a demon? Oh god, reserved. I, I didn't read that. I, I clicked out of it. Is thine... Unnaring self. What do you mean? Why the writing on the walls? That and... And is... Look well into thyself. Referring to this mirror? My reflection is in the mirror. I can't... I can see my reflection. That's... All... Art thou naive, or simply deceiving thyself? This is the chamber of repentance. If thou wishes to leave this place, pick up thy shard, and know thyself. It shattered. A human figure is reflected in the mirror shard. My reflection from, from earlier is still cast in the mirror. What a bizarre mirror. But I better, but I better take this with me. Thy shard is probably referring to this shattered mirror. There's nothing else here. Then I gotta hurry and find the way out and search elsewhere. Mirror shards are scattered all over the floor. All right, let's go to the other room. Some writing emerged on the wall. 
profess thy sin. If thy sin is unknown, rip it out from from thee. I am some uh so I guess the mare shard. Oh? No, that's that's not a death, right? No, but it's going to be. What is this place? There's no way out again. There's writing. Angels of Death Pixel? Yeah. Are thy sins visible? What thou hast committed is blacked out. Hast thou erased thy sins or art thou unaware of thy sins? Oh my god, please don't talk like that. I'm so tired of this shit. If thou hast lost sight of thy sins, fill it in you and accept those which flow out. Fill it in you and accept. Does it mean I should fill the vial that I have? This painting depicts a boy hurriedly running down the road at dusk. Rip the painting. The boy lets out a, scree a shriek as he falls down the hole created by the rip. I can't feel this vibe of a scream. A painting decrypting, de depicting a ram came out of the rip in the painting. Ram painting. Painting de depicting uh, you, you, and uh, you, whatever the fuck that is, came out of the rip in the painting. A snake crawled out of the rip in the painting. The snake's too big to fit into this vial. Besides, I gotta be careful not to get bitten. I can't save. The painting depicts a man holding a hunting rifle. A painting de uh, depicting a lamb came out of the rip in the painting. Also, there's... Is that a rifle coming out of the painting that's about to shoot me in the head? Lamp painting. The muzzle of a hunting rifle peeks out from the rip in the painting. I gotta dodge it. That was close. That gunfire. My vial could have been shattered. Side of a frame is jet black and devoid of painting. An empty black painting. Should I complete it with something? It's a ramp painting. Upon placing the ramp painting, it vanished within the frame. Nothing happens. Maybe it's missing something. Can you leave the... Error. Can you... It vanished within the frame. Nothing happens. Maybe it's missing something. Empty black paint. Should I complete with something? Piece of lamp painting. It vanished within the frame. There we go. The painting of the sheep family emerged within the frame. The painting is now complete, yet nothing happens. If thou hast lost sight of thy sins, fulfill it anew and accept those which flow out. So I ripped this, which means I need to damage this painting. Rip the painting. Red liquid spilled out from the painting. It's so disgusting, I'm gonna go back inside. Oh, the meme, yeah. yeah. Uh, red liquid spilled out from the painting. I think I can put this liquid into the vial. Red liquid is, is now inside the vial. Oh, 
What just happened? I put the liquid into this vial, so what now? It's me. Doesn't look like medicine either. There's nothing of use here. I'll go back and have a look elsewhere. Some writing emerged on the wall. Fast I sinned. This is. Uh... A door. This wasn't here earlier. It shouldn't be here. Oh well. Now I can finally get out of here. Here I go. It's so dark. It's gonna be hard to navigate, let alone search for Zack's medicine. Plus, this place also has that sweet scent. What's with this? This smell? Why is the game framey? It's sweet, yet has a fishy odor to it. I'm spacing out again. Hold on. Why is the game so framey? The door is gone. Does this happen whenever I'm in a hurry? Anyway, I gotta find my way out again. Zack's in trouble. Can I uh, save? Yes. My footprints are bright red. This isn't my blood. But then, whose is it? It doesn't matter. There's no time to sit idly by. I gotta hurry in Tenzak's wounds. Found it, a door. I can hear music playing further inside. Open it. That sweet scent is getting stronger. Maybe it's the smell, but I'm starting to feel woozy. Yeah, definitely feel groggy. The pipe organ music, where's it coming from? From the pipe organ right there. Why? Dost thou repent? Is thine heart which repents for salvation genuine? Can thou consecrate thine sins to God? Yet thine sins remain unseen in thine heart. If you seek salvation, reveal thy, thine sins here. Reveal thine sins here. I don't know if this makes sense to me. But I'll be saved if I do but I'll be saved if I do what it says. Does that mean I can get out of here? I have a charm but I don't get lots of subs. That's normal. That I mean even I don't have all that many. Um like really like like honestly I've been going through like a really slow growth. Um, where, you know, I've, where, uh, you know, like, the, like, I stream more and more, and yet, I don't really gain any, like, subs, which is why, you know, which is why this stream exists, so, you know, if you, if you're going through a slow growth, that's normal, because the YouTube algorithm just, you know, doesn't like most people. The YouTube algorithm just kind of hates everyone. Unless you're already, like, big. 
Vaya. But also, if you are looking for growth, uh, don't do what I'm doing because I don't think it's very healthy. <laughs> like, it, I don't, I don't think it's, uh, it's, uh, good for your health. The organ keys are playing music on their own. Also, it's not good for your computer, especially. A picture of an angel adorns a pipe organ. I possess a vial of red ink. Soiling this picture would grow. Maybe using this liquid will show my sins. Do I know why that Quiet down. My ears and head ache. My ears and head ache like crazy. It's a church. The organ's playing again. Do I seriously have to use, like, old-timey speak for everything this character says? Who art thou? I saw a stream and, and randomly clicked on it. Oh my god, please tell me the algorithm is finally in my favor, please. <laughs> Hello, Fluffy Floopus, how you doing? Why thou... What, why dost thou hold thy tongue? Oh my god. The question is, who are you? I am the preacher of this church. You may call me Gray. Gray, full basta. This is when he gets... <laughs> when Gray gets old, he becomes this guy. A preacher? I believe it is now your turn. Rachel Godna. Uh, rev, uh, rev, 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 rev. God damn it, I hate the F12 function. F12. Uh, rever Reverend, whatever the fuck that says. Are you the resident of this floor? What? Oh my god. Oh wait, my uh... I think my stream elements just banned again. Oh no. Wait, hold up. Stream elements, why? Uh, I guess he was banned. Uh, hold up. I'm so sorry, Stream Elements just just banned you. Ugh. Yep. <laughs> yep, Stream Elements just banned the guy. Shit. <laughs> well. <laughs> um or timed out, not banned, but yeah. Uh if you're still here, uh don't spam next time. I can't undo on timeout, unfortunately, so. Veritably, I suppose to you, I'm a resident of this place.
Uh, wait, no. No, what is that word? Why does it look like that? What's up? Because yes, hello, no one is here. Oh my god. Is you is YouTube finally being nice to me for the first time in my entire like being? <sighs> no fear, my child. I still have yet to determine your nature. Until I learn more about you, I shan't pass any sort of judgment. That's fine. Well then, what brings you here? I'm looking for something to stop bleeding. Hmm. A her- A hemostat, is it? That is what that Zack fellow requires, is it not? That's right, but how did you know that? Of course, I'm more familiar with them than anyone. Regrettably, there is nothing here for treating wounds. Such rem uh, such remedial items could only be found on B5, Daniel's floor. Oh no, then how do I get back below? You desire to return below? Yes. Such a wish should not prove arduous. Come. I shall see it through. Go with you? Yes, my child. I know the way. Can I trust you? My word is my bond. Yet, before we go, you must first pass a bit of a test. A test? It be not a toilsome task, my child. I merely desire to learn more about you. I seek not an immediate answer. Let your heart choose. I shall remain here for a while. So he's the only one who knows how to get back below. I'll go check on Zach and see how he's doing. The Oregon Keys are playing music on their own. Can you do a poll? Uh, for what? The decision is thine own. God desires the pure and sincere. Hence I inquire, what art thou? A sacrifice, an angel? I already read this. Okay, let's go check on Zach. I passed through this place, but it sort of feels like I may have skipped several rooms. Fuck. Shit. Uh, so people... Because so people keep playing Angels of Death on Wild Hearts. I mean, I'm already playing Angels of Death. I might as well finish episode 3. Then I'm, like, when I finish episode 3, I might as well, um... I might as well, I could do the poll to then, um... To then see what people want me to play. But I mean, now that I'm playing episode 3, I might as well just finish it. It's only like an hour or two. Ugh. Zach, hold still. Hey, Ray, where'd you go? I was out looking for something to stop your bleeding. What? By yourself? What the hell's wrong with you? I feel like an old grandpa because I never played... Uh, I never heard of this game. But like, a bunch of people probably in Gen Z play it. Uh... You mean Angels of Death? I feel like it's... I feel like the audience for this game is kind of niche, even though it's popular enough to have gotten an anime adaptation. But I, do, I feel like it's... Um, yeah, it's... I feel like it's not a very common game, so... Yeah. Also, thank you for the sub, no one is here. Stream elements just now informed to me. Uh... That show on the... That show on OBS? 
Uh, yes, it did. Okay. It didn't make a noise for some reason. I don't know why. Uh, what? By yourself? What the hell's wrong with you? I mean, I can't very well force you to uh, move now, can I? Plus, you were sound asleep. Also, like, I feel like Gen Zers don't actually play this game because they're too busy playing Fortnite, probably. <laughs> Plus, you were sound asleep. Idiot. Just whack me till I get up, then. I can't do that. Lol, for real? Yeah. Man, you're stubborn. And so, did you find anything? No. But if I go down to B5, there should be medical supplies. Huh? Going back now? Yeah, but if I go... Suck! Relax for one second. Relax for one second in your life. Zip it, what am I, five years old? My sight's is heavy as hell. This doesn't make a lick of sense. No, you rest. I'll go down below to get your medicine. Zach, you lie down and take it easy. Huh? Zach, you'll lie down. Your, your scythe being heavy is your body telling you that there's something, that something's not right. Don't assume I'm a goner, got that? You know I won't die so easily, right? But... Pretty please, Zach. Give me a chance to actually help you. Please? Don't think for a second that I'm gonna let you. Uh, I'm gonna let you just because you said please. Uh, when little kids each day start saying Fortnite is good, but then they see an actually good game like Minecraft and they say it's garbage. Yeah, well, I, maybe not Minecraft because Minecraft, like that one is kind of a universally liked game. I I feel like, but yeah, that that do be the case. So I hate kids. <laughs> Please. Okay. If... Anyway, how are you gonna get down there? Oh, uh... I'll manage. Can you really manage by yourself out there? The moon is made out of cheese? Honestly, I thought... Honestly, I thought it was made out of honey. Yeah. <laughs> what? How? I don't know. How do you know there aren't bees in space? Can we know? Has anyone tried to taste a moon rock before? Exactly. Where's the hive though? Maybe the moon is the hive. You know how like when you can buy like jars of honey that have like a piece of hive in them? Maybe the moon is the entire hive and we've just never seen the alien bees. But they're probably like twice the size of us. Yeah. Didn't think about that, did we? Yeah. <laughs> Fine. Right now I can't even carry my scythe. I'd probably just be extra baggage like this anyway. No. What else would I be then? Oh, and the game's framing again. But if you think you'll survive, then go for it. You're right. My stomach's killing me and I can't move. I'm gonna get some shut eye. Uh, at the end of it, can you play Sayonara, please? All right, fine. User more recognition. All right, <laughs> thank you. Hold on, let me see how much it play, uh, how much it costs. Depending on the cost, this is Sayonara. What was it called again? Sayonara. Uh, Wild Hearts. It's uh, it's seven bucks. How long is this game? Oh, it's on sale. It's 40% off. Admittedly, it's tempting, but... 
How long is that? Why does a couple pixel on the screen cost money? It won't doesn't make sense. Uh, why is it? Well, pixels on the screen. Well, I get you know people do make. To be fair, games require a lot of effort. They're not very easy to make. So, you know, I guess. No, it, it does make sense. I, I can't explain it very well because I'm bad at explaining things, but... <laughs> okay. Hey, that is pixels on the screen too? I mean... When you think about it, streamers are also pixels on the, on the screen. Code is nothing meaningless. No? There's 24 songs on it. 24 songs. How long is it? Like, uh... Wait, is it a rhythm game? I am really bad at rhythm games if... If that's what it is. Yeah, it's a rhythm game. I mean, I'll tell you right now, I am awful of it, uh, rhythm games. I have no sense of the rhythm. Hey. I feel like a conspiracy theorist right now. <laughs> yeah. While you're at it, hit B6 too. Huh? B6 is where I first found you. I want you to bring me something from there. Got it. Zach passed out again. With an injury like that, I don't blame him. I'll go see that preacher. Uh, I'm not gonna show that. Has thou come to a decision? I need to go back to B5 to get some medicine. So I'll take your test. Hmm. So be it. Let us be off then. Okay. Oh, and do me a favor. Please don't do anything to Zach. Of course. Why is it I smelled a sweet scent coming from him? B5. Is that like a room? Yeah, it's a room. You see right there, it says B2. That's where we are right now. It seems you felt compelled to keep me away from Zack. You need, you need to keep a, a watchful eye on me. No harm shall come to him by my hand. Shall we get going, Rachel Gardner? Why do you help Zack cling to life? If you were going to die, I'd be lost. Be lost? What do you mean? It's because... I want Zack to kill me. Zack made an oath to God. Interesting. So that's your incentive. Heavens, this terrible oath you have forged. What is the current situation right now in the game? Uh, we made it out of two rooms that... Uh, well, technically three. We made it out of three rooms with people trying to kill me. Uh, and now... My, uh, my partner in crime is, uh, dying because he stabbed himself with his scythe. That... 
doesn't make sense out of context now that I think about it, but like it, 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 it the events kind of led to that. It's like an ex escape thing. Yeah, it's an escape thing. Yeah, we need to escape from this place. And then once we escape, uh, the other guy kills us. <laughs> Heavens, this is a terrible if you have forged. Just as I suspected. The sweet scent. It's coming from him. Rachel. Rachel Gardner. Ah. Well, for now we have arrived at B3. What is the matter? It's nothing. I just had something in my eyes, that's all. Henceforth, all I can do is offer you sage advice. No need to be intimidated. I sh it shan't prove difficult. To operate the elevator leading down from here, thou must find the mechanism and press the switch. The B3 switch is located in the jail. If you can press it, then I shall open the I shall open up the elevator. the jail. That's where Zack stumped on an arm uh, that was sticking out from one of the cells. Time to get moving. <laughs> Kathy's uh, penchant is uh, for the Kathy's penchant for deception has made floor B3 more trap-laden trap than any other. She was gifted at using them to preach, to reach people emotionally, and thus lead them to seek self-reproach uh, and salvation. Though she always was a bit of a spent thrift. Let us call it one of her charms, shall we? Hence, there could still be some seeking self-reproach and salvation. Now then, I will go ahead and wait for the. Uh, I'll go ahead and wait by the elevator that uh, descends to the floors below. Okay. So this is a horror game. Yep, it's a horror game. Uh, there's five bosses in Sayonara. There's like two people in the chat right now. It says five, but either there's three lurkers or YouTube viewer count is wrong, which it probably is to be fair. <laughs> I'm fairly sure the jail was further down this way. Gotta make it quick. What if I go this way? Which is fuck, yeah. The elevator still ain't working. Okay. YouTube is glitch of as fuck changed my mind. I won't. You're right. <laughs> Uh, was it here? No, that was the... I teach you how to play Sayonara. Okay, here's the thing, right? It's really hard to... Oh, wait. The iron bars are open. I should be able to get to the jail cells through here. The here here's the thing, right? Rhythm games are really hard to play just in general, right? Like, even if you... Like, even if I had someone telling me what to do... It would still be hard just for reaction time. And already I'm blind as fuck, right? Like, if I'm stuttering on my words when reading, that's because I just can't see. <laughs> well, I can't see, but I, I'm basically blind. I still hear voices. You get like a thousand notifications from YouTube on your phone one day, and it's just little Timmy spam liking your video. Uh. She only registered the one like. 
Uh, I mean, I, if that helps the algorithm, short. Sure. <laughs> There's no illumination yet. The back of the jail cell is fully visible. It shouldn't keep growing. Hey, I mean, better for me, I guess. <laughs> Yeah, but it gets annoying. Yeah, I can mute YouTube. And plus, like, that's just kind of what happens with growth. So, it's not that bad. But nothing special appears to be here. There's no illumination, yet the back of the jail cell is fully visible. Okay, well, it says the same for... Uh, spam like and refresh the page and see what happens. Auto clicker time. Oh god. This was the only place where that arm looking thing popped out. Something's here. Is that the switch he mentioned? Also, wait, um. Now that I think about it, YouTube doesn't actually notify me when someone likes a video. So... And nothing. I'll leave the like. I'll keep the like. <laughs> yeah, no, YouTube doesn't notify me when someone likes a video. It does notify when, like, it likes a comment, but that's kind of it. And also, I think it only likes, like, one like, really. Something's here. Is that the switch you mentioned? Can I reach it? Just a little further. Run. Oh. Ru oh, wait. They don't actually... Um... Oh. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I thought... Uh, I forgot to run. I was adjusting my earphone. <laughs> I was adjusting my earphone and I didn't have my... My, uh... My hands on the keys. Hold on. Okay, now I can run. Apparently, he also kills me. What the fuck? When did that happen? Okay, sure. Alright. Trial and error. You keep... Uh, run away from the monster. Yes, I will, I will. Don't worry. This is the attempt. This is the attempt. There you go. It was the easiest thing ever. <laughs> uh, what were those things? Gas, 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 I'm gonna step on the gas. Tonight we fight to be a lover. Yeah, 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 I'll be so quick as a flash. What were those things? It doesn't look like they'll follow me here, though. I can't get into the gel like this. Mm. Those things are in the way. They're your nightmares, yeah, probably. Can't use my gun anymore. What do I do now? Oh, I, I got it. The floor has traps all over the place. The jail's over there. There should at least be a way to deal with them when they come out of, the, of their cells. I don't have nightmares? Well, yeah. My whole life is a nightmare. I'll check out uh, the room with the machine that controls this floor. Not there. That's the electric chair room. I'm surprised Rachel actually remembers where the layout of, it, of things are. I'm gonna say the most random thing now. As long as it's not problematic, go right ahead. Not here. 
Wait, actually, it's here, isn't it? Yep, there we go. The body's gone. Jizz of blood, an arm and a whip uh, are all that remain. Why? The... Uh... uh what in the... I didn't get that from Wikipedia, totally. Even if you did, I still wouldn't know what the fuck that is. Okay, sure. Uh, oh my... That is random, what the fuck? Hey Ali, how you doing? Ciao. A plethora of buttons uh, lying on lying the device. It appears to be used on this floor. Say something in Italian. Um a book after like a dica. Um There you go. That was something in Italian. A plethora of buttons lying the device. It appears to be used on this floor. I should be able to- uh, please shut up. Please. Buffy, no, stop. I'll time you on myself. Um, I should be able to bring up a security video here. It's this room. And the device mechanism for this room. This is harder than I thought. Is is this it? Here we are. From here, I can look at the screen and shoot them. I wonder if she was, sh if she was shooting would-be escapees with this. Could that be why there's so many of them here? I'm short on time. I gotta hurry. I just need to align the crosshair and press this button. Then I can safely enter this room. Uh, aim, crosspad, fire, confirm button. Go for the leg instead of headshots. Oh, that's cool. Oops. I'm trying my goddamn hardest to. Ah, is this even working? Um. Oh, finally. There we go. See, this wasn't so hard. Come on. Oh. There we go. See? I'm just gonna... Um, hold on. Let me just, uh... Come on, just... Just die, you motherfucker! This is bugged as all hell. Um... Why does it not... There we go, thank you. Please just die. Just die. Do I have to repeatedly keep shooting or... I can't... Um... Very nice. Pepperoni is how you say pepperoni in Italian. Uh, it actually isn't. I mean, yes, it. I mean, it, it's you say it like that, but it's not actually what it means. Okay, he's dead. 
There we go. And now you. Google Translate is stupid, yeah. A little bit. Come on. Fucking die. Just fucking die. Please. Oh my god. Uh, there's one here, isn't there? Yes, there is. The game is frozen. Oh. Thank you. Yeah. Cool. No, that, that's cool. That, that's really cool. Come on, just... Just fucking die already. Bro, is immortal or what? Yeah, no, I've been shooting these guys like there's no tomorrow. I... I'm literally shooting at their legs. What in the fuck? <laughs> the game literally... Like, the, the theme literally restarted. I'm... They, they should have holes literally in every single part of their body right now. Like, they should literally be a speck with how full their holes they have. Oh my god. If they had an assault rifle, I would, imme rifle would, immediately, would immediately use it. Come on. Just... I can't... Oh my god, don't tell me they need to be backed into a corner before... Oh my god. I never want to do that one again, that was awful. How can I pass through safely? My lord, yeah. What a terrible thing you've done. Disposing of those who lament in pain and suffering like yesterday's garbage. And yet you show no emotion. You stop at nothing to have Zack take your life. Little girl don't laugh at me. Ah, uh, no, she's an adult. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure we're the little girl in this in this case. Rachel, you truly are a sinful woman. <laughs> yeah, I guess. <laughs> what was that? Wait, it's gone. She's back, I thought she was dead. She is. I don't get it. At any rate, I gotta hurry. I shot them all, so I shouldn't be obstructed anymore ah no this is no time to worry about that now I'm sure I shot them there's no trace of them oh there's a switch a bit further back in the cell gotta shoot them all yes <laughs> I think this is it. Okay. I pressed the jail s switch now. That sound. Was it the elevator? I gotta see him now. It appears you managed to- you managed to press the switch. Yes. Uh... Rever- I- I'm not even gonna- I call 911 so they can kill those monsters. Uh, what is that chat thing above your head supposed to do? It's supposed to show chat, but uh, I can't get it to work anymore. So for the past year, it's just been there doing nothing. Yeah, that, that, I, I, I don't know why I can't get it to work anymore. And did you accomplish this feat? 
delete it then I can't because it's part of the layout It's part of the layout. It literally cannot be deleted. <laughs> kind of cringe in it, bruv. Oh, God. Uh, did not a soul give chase or impede your progress? No, somebody did, but I shot them all. Is that so? And what was your reasoning for such an act? Because they were in the way. Fair. I see. Well, time is short. Let us carry on to the next floor. Did you try fixing the chat on it? Yeah, I did. I tried fixing it. Uh, I think I tried. I also tried fixing it like on my last endurance stream or the one, the one before that, like the 50 hour one. It was either the 24 or the 50 hour one. And I, I like, you can see it for yourself. It looked very off. Like it did not look right. Well, we have arrived, Rachel Gardner. Uh, huh. As you requested, floor B4. Moral of the story is chatbox stupid monster gone, yes. <sighs> the switch here is within the water temperature control room. Why must you do all of this? What do you mean? That's all you need to know, yeah. For a while now, your actions have been confusing me. I just want to go downstairs to find some medicine. This is all for the sake of learning who you are. Who I am? Indeed. But you see, you are an... You are irregular. A lamentable lamb, or perhaps a demon. Also, I am monitoring your actions during this test. He's not talking in old timey speak anymore. He's now using modern lingo. He wants to learn more about me. But that. That shouldn't matter to him. The power unit running. Alright. Hmm? The gravestone's act destroyed. Has it been moved somewhat? Not again. What's wrong with me? How am I able to see the dead now? This is no time to be scared. Everyone like the streamer get teed back to your dream. Hey, that actually rhymed. Oh, well, yeah, it did. Just like the stream I haunt your dream. <laughs> the funny thing is, this is probably like the stream that I like my chat has been the most active I think the last time I've had a chat semi-active was my fucking V2 appreciation stream like two years ago so it does <laughs> so yeah YouTube is finally giving me a bone and it says power room ah yes 2021 the year of COVID. Upon closer inspection, I see this place has been utterly ruined. Eddie was a nice boy, to be true. Furious, he mu uh, and Donald Trump. That was a little bit before that, I think. That was like, what, 2018, 19, I'm pretty sure. 
Eddie was a nice boy to be true. Furious, he must have... Uh, he must have been that his graveyard were the target of vill villainous devastation. 2020 was more like the year of COVID. In 2021, the COVID scene wasn't so serious. It started to go away. Uh, I would say early 2021 was... Was, uh... Was still kind of impacted by COVID. And then midway through the year, it went away, kind of. And now it's basically like not ex non-existent. Well, it, it it's existent, but like, you know, people, you know, people who catch it don't really have much of a problem. It's the year when he said the election was rigged. Oh, well, but guess what? What? Uh, I'm just, I just kind of want to see. Okay. Um, more variants. Yeah. All right. And he was a nice boy to be true. Furious he must have been that his grades were the target of villainous devastation. Perhaps his kind heart is to blame for his tendency to, re to receive the short end of the stick. A piteous fellow. Yeah, I guess there were still variants of the coronavirus at that time. Uh, Delta corn, for example. Yeah. Um, but it's those who are meant to be resisting in their resting in their graves who should be pitied the most. Eddie was compassionate enough to give them a resting place for the cleansing of their souls. Now even that wish shan't be granted. Well, I shall go on ahead. You may resume your errand. There's something sticking out from the broken gravestones. Let's have a moment of silence for the dead. Yeah, let's let's have a moment of silence for the dead. After after she stopped speaking. Uh sticking out from the broken gravestones. Uh those shouldn't be here. But no need to worry about that now. I've got to go to the temperature control room. I'm pretty sure it's at the back of the room to the right. Okay. Moment of silence. Alright, moment over. Says Morg. I don't think that's. I don't think it was here that I needed to. Oh, I guess it is. Were there coffins here before? I don't think there were. Lasted one second. Awesome, yeah. There's a large hole in the wall. The control room for the water temperature. It should be through here. Uh, oh, it's... Uh, temperature control device. Uh... Temperature is displayed. An icy chilly... Uh, an icy chill. Not chilly. An icy chill. Uh, pervades the air, there's a refrigerator, something's written on it. Only for my use. Upon opening the refrigerator, a breeze of chilly air begins to waft out. There's nothing inside. Chilly dog. Are you having a seizure? Oh, you're talking to Ever. Oh. Second I hear chilly, I think of chilly dog. The, th the second I think of Chili, I think of, like, Pokemon. Ah, there's a hole in the back. But I can't seem to reach it. If I had something long and thin, I'm just hungry, I guess. Those three... Oh. Okay. Uh, 
ever is uh not okay. <laughs> he's uh he's referencing a meme. Door is tightly shut. It's like I guess I'm done here. Oh. Hi. There's a broken pickaxe. It's broken, but it might still have some use left in it. Not okay. Grass grows, birds fly, the sun shine. I mean, the sun shining is like the worst thing in the world. So... <laughs> but it's not long enough. Uh, I'll go find something to make it longer. The object's protruding from the gravestone is moving on its own. I think that's a hand-shaped stuffed toy. I guess it's a moving toy. Ah. If I tie that to a stick with some string, then... Can I... I can step on them, can't I? Yes, I can. Acquired toy hand. Just stare at the sun for a bit, you'd go blind. <laughs> yeah, no, I want to. I want to. I want to step on these. There we go. Alright, toy hand. That should be. That should do it. Try attaching it to. I'll try attaching it to that pickaxe. Don't chase me around like that. I have enough hands now, I don't need you. I've done it. There's a broken pickaxe. If I attach the toy hands to this and make it longer... First, I'll sew them together. And combine them. <laughs> then if I attach it onto the tip of the broken pickaxe... Required strange pickaxe. Okay. Now I should be able to reach the back of the refrigerator. I'm gay tabati tabadai. It appears to be a refrigerator... Only for use right now. Only for... Blah, blah, blah. There's a deep hole in the refrigerator. Uh, no, I want it... Use the... Strange pickaxe. I should be able to reach the back if I use this. This thing's so odd. It's not broken and it's still wiggling a little. Good. This was the right switch. I gotta hurry to the elevator that goes down to the floors below. The toy hand stopped moving. I saw that, Rachel. How terrible. Just terrible. Hey, does hearing a sad scream not make you feel anything, Rachel? Don't you want to comfort whoever screamed? Ever considered what makes you a, what makes that person happy? You only think about yourself, Rachel. And blatantly ignore anyone else's happiness. That's why everyone around you, even Zack, will no doubt suffer and meet their end. Not again. How awful. A sad scream. I feel nothing. Suffer and meet their end. Even Zack? But I... 
No. I mustn't think about this. The next floor, B5, has the medicine. I gotta hurry and go, and go back there. I press the switch. It appears so. Rachel Gardner. How did you manage to press the switch? I attached the toy hand to a pickaxe and pressed it with that. Interesting. Did they wail in agony? No. How can you be so sure? I mean, it was just a toy hand after all. I see. They must have appeared to you as such. So be it. If that is what you saw, then it must be true. Please let me go down to the next floor. Very well. Hmm. We have arrived at B5. You wish to come here, did you not? Yeah. Then make haste and find your medicine. Daniel is a fastidious man, but he is nevertheless scrup scrupulous, dedicated and unbiased in his work. Surely he has medicine you seek. Uh, what if it's made out of gold? Moon's made out of cheese? I think it's made out of tofu, probably. <laughs> Nevertheless, it seems Danny has been a trifle obs obsessive as of late. Well, I mean, maybe. <laughs> what is tofu even made of? <laughs> Now that I think about it, I actually don't know. So is the moon vegan then? I mean, probably. Nevertheless, it seems Danny has been a trifle obsessive, obsessive as of late. Unlimited tofu, yeah. Maybe the moon is made out of cheese? The moon? Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna... I'm gonna, I'm gonna spit straight facts now, right? The moon... Is made out of the moon. Boom. Mind-blowing, I know. <laughs> um... What is it? There's something I need to get on B6 as well. Scream into your mic. I, I didn't even scream. That was a whisper. I just I just like got really close to the mic. Do it. I won't do it because it's 9 p.m. And people can probably already hear me outside. So I or I'll find your IP. Do it. I dare you. Oh, very well. In fact, I'll tell you my IP. It's 42069. There you go. That's my IP. Very well. Sure it's okay? Yes. Return to the elevator once you have found the medicine. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Time to find that medicine. I'm positive there should be some here. Although, I was in a complete daze and didn't take a good look around when I was here before. I passed through this floor before, but something seems a bit out of place. It's been bothering me the whole time, but I can't put my finger on it. Oops. Hmm, the walls in the elevator are exactly as they were. 
Even Zack's vomit is still there. It. Well, this wasn't any anime. Um, I think scream at the mom would be better, cause <laughs> given my. Something's really not right here. I'm out of here. Ow. Groan. Huh? What happened just now? What in the world? But the, th the whole thing's left me feeling strangely refreshed. It bothers me. Never mind that, I gotta find that medicine. Zack's depending on me. I tried the operating room. Seems like a place where I could find some. Zack. Uh... Damn it, stream elements! Ugh. Broken glass? Oh yeah, no, that was there before. The doctor's missing. Oh no, where is he? I'm pretty certain there wasn't a body in B3 or B4 either. But... The only... The only trace of him being dragged is here. Something's off. I'll forget that for now. My first priority is finding some medicine. The room in the back should have a shelf with specimens and drugs. No, I'm pretty sure it only has eyeballs, but okay. There are a lot of empty bottles. There are numerals glass eyes in there. In here. Numerals eyeballs pop out. Some sort of machine is running. The drugs have been all taken out, leaving only the eye specimens. The drugs are gone. I'll scour all the drug shelves on this floor if I have to. The security camera is broken. Inside's also been ransacked. They're gonna say a bad word to me, but luckily I'm ignoring him. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I'm I ch like checking his because uh, I can actually see like what uh, like he got banned from stream uh, from uh, stream elements, but. Yeah, he was, uh, he, he was, yeah. <laughs> Just needs to stop spamming and probably stop using caps lock also. Wait, you banned him? No, I didn't ban him. Uh, stream elements did. It's my, uh, my bot. I have a, I have a, like a bot in chat. So whenever someone spams in the chat it, or like says something bad, it, I thought I didn't make it as strict as it, as it is, but. In the end, in the end, it, it's uh, it's doing some stuff. Oh well, but yeah, no, it, he's not even banned. He's just timed out for five minutes. The insides are also ransacked. There's nothing here. Oh yeah, the inside uh, of the fences is in shambles. The security camera is broken. Writing on the wall is smeared with dirt, making it illegible. So he's timed out? Yeah. The interior has been ransacked, leaving no place to step. 
There's too much debris to pass through, and it's completely destroyed. Bed is neatly made. Thought you got banned from the stream? No, he's gonna come back. The glass rack is unlocked. Unfortunately, the medicine has been taken out, leaving it bare. It's gone. All gone. The medicine's all gone. Did someone make... Did someone make off of it? What? Take off, I think you meant. I gotta get back. And see Zack. But I also gotta go to B6. Zack asked me to... I gotta hurry. There's some sort of medical chart inside. Much of it appears to be about eye-related ailments. The computer shows data regarding eye illnesses. What is the matter? You look ghastly. Hurry and take me to B6. And so I shall, but did you find any medicine? No. Nothing? You told me there would be medicine here on B5, but that turned out to be false. Hmm, well... I oh, mean, yeah, it's supposed to be a joke, but... Like, you know, you can't really do that through, like, text. It has to be, like, vocal. Because through text, you either you wouldn't be able to tell sarcasm, you know? Hmm, well... Perhaps you doubt my words, but... Do not look upon me with accusing eyes. I too am unaware as to why the medicine is missing. Yet I can guess that you are to blame, Rachel Gardner. It has nothing to do with me. Has it never crossed your mind that you have played a part in all these unfortunate events? I told you it has nothing to do with me. Never mind that. Hurry and take me to B6. Very well. Let us be on our way then. <laughs> oh, so you're alive. But you're so weak. Shall I finish you off, Zack? <laughs> wakey, wakey. You never change, do you, Zack? It amazes me that you can move so nimbly in that shape. But look at you. You're almost out of breath. The hell are you doing here? Surprised? I knew all along that you were attempting to go after Rachel and leave this floor. So I hid a bit of a safety precaution under my clothes just in case. I had no idea. No idea that you'd actually show up though. <laughs> Alright. I'll slash you good one more time. You mustn't push yourself, Zack. Look at you. Such a slow poke. Ah. Huh? Besides all that, just give it a rest. Even I didn't make it out unscathed, okay? 
my body armor and blood uh, and blood transfusion packs got hit hard, resulting in this mess. You seem pretty peppy, consider. You seem pretty peppy, considering, if you ask me. That's what separates you and I. Proper preparation, advance, and clean up afterwards, though. And clean up afterwards, though. I'm just as frantic as you are. I thought about killing you in your sleep, but you woke up. There goes that idea. Tell me, why are you accompanying Rachel? And why? And where is she, anyways? Are you seriously asking me that? <laughs> as if I'd ever tell you where she is, you fuck. What would you do if I said I killed her, huh? You trash. Who do you... Who do you think's been admiring her eyes? Are you trying to say you killed her? Don't fuck around with me. Those eyes are unique. They've been searching my whole... I've been searching my whole life for eyes like those. Alive yet dead and so tranquil and beautiful. You think I'm gonna let someone like you have her eyes? They're all mine. Mine. I've been admiring them for so long. Who gives a flying fuck? I couldn't care less about her eyes. But she wants me to kill her. And I'll be the one to do it. So whatever happens to Rey is in yours to decide. Fine. Have it your way then. I know she's alive. You being here on this floor is proof of that. Uh... Okay. Ah, yes. Allow me to make a proposal, my battered friend. Ah? Uh -huh. To tell you the truth, I have lots of medicine on my person. Want me to use it to save you? That is, if you scoop out Rachel's eyes and give them to me. I just told you that I have no fucking interest in Ray's eyes. Count me out. Without her eyes, I couldn't laugh and smile. Uh, without her eyes, her laugh and smile would be empty. I thought I told you to leave me alone about her stupid eyes. I'm not giving you anything, you bastard. Oh my, what a fool. I'll take my leave then. Ah. I'll lose to a monster like you in my current state. You can't even walk properly by yourself, right? In that case, I should hoof it out of here while I can. Besides, I gotta make preparations to, pr to protect her eyes. Hey, shit. Wait. <sighs> we have arrived at B6. And Zach's floor corresponds to his mystique. This uncomplicated in design. Now make haste. Gotta get it and hurry back. So, it's inside the place Zach and I first met. That's what around here is uh somewhere around here. Dimly lit and obscure. Inside here?
this room. This this place is a pigsty, but it feels like somebody was here. Could this be where Zack was staying? I know I'm in a hurry, but I'm a bit curious about all this. A broken glass cup uh, sits neglected on the desk. The cup appears to contain some kind of drink. How unsafe. But there are no signs of someone drinking from it. Drinking from a broken cup. There's a tattered magazine. Uh, best, best, whatever the fuck that says. With, with scribbles. Drink it, it doesn't let me. Uh, there's graffiti around it that is identical to the scribbles. Maybe Zack wrote this. No, that's right. Zack can read. Empty cans of carbonated beverages are strewn on the floor. Does he like this soda or something? Uh, dirty used bandages are discarded on the floor. half eaten bag of snacks is on the floor. The contents are mushy. A bunch of the Satan soda cans are on the floor. A dirty knife lies on the crate. Is this what Zach was talking about? It's awfully dirty and not to mention a little rusty. Seems like it wasn't maintained very well. That's odd. The blade. It looks razor sharp. I'll bring it along just in case. Acquired knife. Right after I do a quick final sweep. Soiled blankets are scattered all over the uh, dilapidated sofa. It's a sh it's a shoddy hard spring sofa. The blankets are thin. Does not provide much warmth. A single bandage lays between the sofa. Card bandage. A bandage, good. There's no burn medicine. I think there's probably nothing else left. Gotta hurry and get back. There's a middle-aged gar middle garbage man living here. Yeah, Zack. <laughs> Zack. So he spent his time here like this. I had no idea. To be fair, this is the average teenager bedroom, like... <laughs> Come to think of it, I don't know anything about Zack. Omori cube? It's the blink 182 posters. It ain't a teenager. <laughs> there isn't blink 182 posters. Who the fuck is blink 182? Also. Time to head back and see Zach. Did you finish your errand on B6? Some emo band thing? I don't know. See, this is where you're wrong. Because... Teenagers, unless they're like... Unless they're like on their like edgy emo phase, they don't actually li listen to emo band, they listen to trap. That's what teenagers do. They're, they're even worse than emo teens. An average teenager is actually worse than, than like an emo teen. <laughs> also, let me just... Or like punk, I guess. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so I want to hurry and get back to B2. Very well. Let us return then. Yes, please.
What is the matter? Oh no. He's gone. Zack's gone. I am not able to produce him. Even if you continue to stare at me like that. Are you being truthful? Indeed I am. Just as I suspected, the one behind this chain of misfortune was none other than THE Rachel Gardner. I cannot understand what you're writing half the time. What the fuck does that mean? What is it with you? I told you it has nothing to do with me. Was Daniel B5? He is the only one whose whereabouts are unknown to me. Why would such an earnest and sensible man start acting so bizarre? It is you who is behind this, is it not? Zack built like a couple of pixie sticks, changed my mind. Uh... I mean, the only reason why he's, like, the only reason why, like, he's, like, barely standing is because the motherfucker stabbed himself with his own scythe, which is, like, the, the same size of, as he is, so. I wouldn't say so. Noodle arms looking. I mean, apparently he has a, apparently that scythe is, like, really heavy, so. I wouldn't say so. <laughs> Why did such an earnest and sensible man start acting so bizarre? It is you who is behind it, is it not? It's not my fault. Never mind that. I gotta, I, uh, I gotta find Zack. Strong new alarms. I guess, yeah. Wait. I've been watching thee. I have grown curious. I have grown curious as to what sort of meddling hellion you are. If painful, then justice must be swift. Though the sight of you searching for medicine for Zack did offer a glimmer of hope. Alas, it seems I was mistaken. Your actions abound with self and selfishness and ruthlessness. And the answer you gave me at the outset. How often do you live stream? Whenever I feel like it. I, I either stream like like once every few days or weeks or like once a month if I feel like it. It really just depends on like on my mood for streaming. Uh, but right here I'm just streaming pretty much non-stop. So, yeah, and the answer you gave me at the outset as to why you are trying to keep Zack alive, because you wish for him to take your life. Oh, Rachel Gardner, live streams nowadays be like, what's the stream schedule? No, really, like, if anything, I'm the only one that doesn't have a stream schedule. Because, like, everyone I know, like, just has a stream schedule whenever, and, like, they're super neat about it. And then there's just me who is, like, I don't need a stream schedule. <laughs> That's mostly just, you know, due to the fact that, like, I, I feel like I wouldn't be able to commit to a stream schedule. I make videos. Oh, cool. Oh, Rachel Gardner. All of your actions are without a doubt selfish. For you love only yourself. No. Sure, I want Zack to kill me. But it's not just about that. There's more to it. Zack swore an oath to God that he would take my that he would take my life. You say Zack swore an oath to God. However, 
Even if he didst make that oath, how would you know if God will choose to allow it? If there were others the same oath, do you think, do you not think that it is God's will to determine which, which shall come to pass? Spooky organ music, yeah. Should the will of the God differ from your own? What then will you do? Forgive me, it was a rather heartless question. Now I must make preparations before I sentence you. Huh? That sweet scent, could it be? Well then, day to the God or not? Let the deliberation proceed. What just happened? What was I doing just now? The will of God. Never mind about me. The man's not here. I gotta hurry and find Zack. What? A giant snake. I gotta get away. Duck. Duck, wake up. Huh? There's a giant snake, run. What are you talking about? Look, it's right there. Listen to me. Hurry. We'll take the door behind us. I'm uh, talking to you. Step on it. Hurry. Tuck. Ah, shut up. Oops. Don't give me oops. What the hell are you talking about anyway? But a giant snake. You must be imagining things. Are you fucked in the head? Don't make me pound your head again. Just when I think you're back, you don't make any sense and you're all freaked out. I knew you couldn't handle yourself all alone out there. I'm... I'm sorry. Are you alright, Zack? Why did you move here? I had an unwanted visitor. Dr. Danny? Yep. The one and only. How'd you know? His body was missing. That makes sense. Cocky bastard. I couldn't move, so the bastard bolted before I could finish him off. Did Danny say anything? Huh? Who cares? It's nothing you need to be worrying about. I see. Never mind all that, you came back alive. Huh? What's wrong? I'm sorry. All the medicine on B5 was gone. Come to think of it. That mass... That bastard mu muttered something about having the medicine. So he did have a hand in this. Is it okay if I uh, if can read the subtitles on the game? Go right ahead. That, that's literally what I'm reading. <laughs> hey, did you make it to B6 and get the stuff I told you about? Oh, that, yeah. That's all I need. Hey, let me see it. Is this what you wanted? Alright, now this I can wield. Is that knife yours? Oh, this was my original go-to guy before all this. Hey, what do you say you gotta move on? No, wait. 
You're still in no shape to move around. Man, you're pesky. I got some major Z's earlier, so I can manage. Wait. Then, at least let me treat your wounds. Back off. Don't get any ideas about touching or do anything to me. It'll take more than some cuts and bruises to take me down, so you don't- so don't you worry. That won't do. What is with you? You've had the weird look on your face ever since you got here. Can I read it? Yeah, go ahead. But I'm not stopping you. No. <laughs> Hey, do you remember what that woman said on B3? Huh? When I think that she was right, it makes me want to puke. But she wasn't wrong about one thing. I'm gonna read at the bottom. The bottom? When I think she was right, it makes me want to puke, but if she wants to blah, blah. No, you and I aren't playthings. Not that part. You already gave your spiel on that, so I remember it. What then? The part about me being a monster. A monster doesn't go down so easily. Wouldn't you say that was true? Shimon will so deal with that. Huh? Come on now. Wouldn't you quit making that weird face? That's pretty much normal for a monster. That's always been normal for me. Hey, quit spacing out. Whatever the case, all we can do is keep going. There's no medicine. There's no medicine. Wait, whatever the case, all we can do is keep going if there's no medicine. If you're not coming, then I'll leave you behind. Wait, I'll go. Then hurry your ass up. But just so you know, I can't run right now. Okay, I got it. There's a trail of blood. Is this Dr. Danny's? Fuck if I know. Well, I'm pretty sure he was dripping with blood. Dripping with blood? But he was still alive? He was packing insurance under his clothes. At any rate, if Danny has medicine, then we gotta track him down. Let's follow the blood trail. This door is open. And the blood trail leads this way. Did Dr. Danny pass through here? Hey, Zuck. Huh? What's up? Earlier you refused to... Oh, earlier you referred to yourself as a monster. Does that mean you're not human? Well, let me ask you. Define human for me. What's a decent human being to you? Those desired by God? <laughs> what the hell? Is that what you freaking think about? Anyway, I'm a decent and normal guy no matter what. Or am I something else? Does your so-called god say it's unforgivable to be killed by a monster? I'll read the bottom because I can't read it on top because it has... Password, sorry, on bottom. Okay, but I still gotta read it for the stream. No, I'm like... <laughs> no, my god doesn't say that. My god doesn't say that. 
Look at you getting all serious now. Ah, shit. I said something dumb. Fuck, let's get going. Oh, I can't run because Zuck can't run. Hey, Zuck. Were you staying in that room where I found the knife? What about that room? I was just curious. Ha! Huh? This has to do with uh, what we talked about earlier. But I know nothing about you, Zach. Yeah, for some reason, I just got curious. What the hell? Man, you're weird. Um, I think that room could use a bit more tidying up. Ah, uh, who the fuck cares? It's not like I'm ever going back there again, so it doesn't matter anyway. Art painting, a snake adorns the wall. Ah. Oh. I hear something. Snakes? Hey, stop spacing out. It's a real thing this time. Run, go on ahead without me. I'll find a, a way out of here. Ah, shit. Can't slash them all in one go with this dirt, this dinky knife. Hey, I thought I told you to hurry. Okay. Found the exit, and it's unlocked. Zuck, there's a way out here. I'm coming, so wait for me. Hurry, Zuck. Ah. Zuck. This is bullshit. I can't run. My size is too heavy. What kind of torture are you putting me through? Zuck, you're bleeding. Oi, let's move. I didn't kill all the snakes. Okay, let's get out of here. Stay put and take it easy. It might be fatal. Oi. I told you it'd take more than that to take me down. Nope. I won't have it. Stay put. But that... That look on your face. Alright, my head out. Have fun. Tuck. Just take it easy here. From here on, from here on out, I'll manage by myself. I can't promise uh, to find some medicine this time. Oi, you've been acting weird for a while now. What the hell's going into you? Huh? That gloomy face. What's the mouse? Oh, there it is. That gloomy face. What do you know something... What, do you know something I don't? No, I... Never mind that. Gotta find some medicine as soon as possible. Don't ignore my question. Plus, you're as good as dead out out there without me. Oh, uh, I have a gun. As long as I have this. Even if that doctor's around. Alright then, let me see it. Boy. Let me see it. Bang. Crap. No bullets. 
Hey, what's the point in packing an, unload an unloaded gun? What are you thinking? Ah, shit. That's all you're... That's all you're taking. And you're just gonna get yourself killed out there. Aren't you willing to be killed by me? Even so... You're freaking out over the fact that I could... Bite the big one. What do you want from me? What's going through your head? You swore to God for me. Shit, here we go again. Can you really trust a monster to follow through a promise like that? You're not a liar, right? Oh, sorry. Nope, my word is my word. Then... But... There's no God in this world. You're wrong. Huh? If no God exists, then what... What am I supposed to do? But, Zuck... It's not just that you swore to God for me. But even if someone were to swear to God for me, it wouldn't be the same. What then? I don't know. I don't know, I'm sorry. What the hell is up with you? Do me a favor. And smile. <laughs> God, I'm getting tired. And smile. Huh? But right now, I don't know if I can do it right. I know you suck at it, just do it. Duck. I'm gonna sleep now. Do whatever you like. Oi. Take this. It's probably too much for you, though. Duck. Uh, blade edge of the dirty knife. Gleams of sharpness. Acquired knife. This knife. I wonder if I can wield it. Uh. No. Don't want it. This sweet scent. Yeah, it's getting to me. It's making me feel woozy. Same. <laughs> mm. Smells like it must be dangerous. I gotta... gotta hurry. The gate is shut. Upon closer inspection, there is water running with faint uh, pungent odor. There's something at the bottom of the water. I think I can press it. Could be a switch. This water would burn my skin if I touch it. I gotta press this switch without letting the water touch my skin. The gate is tightly shut. It won't open. Is there some kind of release mechanism? There's nothing... But water around here. Wonder if something's in the water. Can't go back. Hmm. 
Okay, hold on. Immersion. Oh, oh no, 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 no. What happened here? Why? Uh, can I? Shit. Uh, hold up. Let me just uh. Uh, hold on, hold on. I got this. I got this. Don't worry, guys. It's all part of the plan. Um. Oh no. Uh, oh, that's almost perfect. Hold up. Uh, okay. Now I just need to... There we go. There we go. Pretty much back to normal. Pretty much. Okay. Um. Cool. One question is. Uh, just switch. Wonder if I can dip my knife in this water. Are you gonna play Sayonara? I'm really bad at rhythm games, I'm sorry. But honestly, you can suggest most other games as long as they don't cost all that much. And, or if they're, preferably they're free. It opened. The knife. Ah, it's alright. There's a lever, but it won't oper operate. It appears power must uh, be supplied to operate it. Okay, it's tightly shot. Here too, huh? There's a large lever. Looks like I could open the gate with it. There's an electrical cord, but it's been uh, severed. Well, I can teach you how to do it. I just said. Like I told you before, like... It's not about, like, knowing how to play it. Because I can figure that out easily. It's about, you know, actually being able to play it. Because I don't have the right reaction time. I'm just, I just have no sense of rhythm, really. That's really the problem. There's an electrical cord, but it's been severed. If I could somehow supply power. Oh, you're right, yeah. Can I use the knife here? Knife's made of metal. Electricity could pass through it. Here goes nothing. You're gonna electrocute yourself. Now power supplied. Wait, really? That's actually how it works? Excuse me? The lever can now operate. Alright, now it should work. Gotta hurry and remove the knife from the electrical cord. Knife. The handle is somewhat melted. The blade's still fine. I wonder if it's okay to keep using it like this. A mirror adorns the wall. What to do? There doesn't seem to be anything else here. This mirror, can I break it with my knife? Thrust the knife into the mirror. I've found a game. Uh, f uh found. And 
a game that is not a rhythm game. That would be better, yeah. I did it. That would be better, but also, like, my computer can handle very few things. And... Yeah. Kinda looks like a knife is stabbing a knife. The mirror is rigid. It looks like Zack's knife could penetrate it. Alright. Oh, the knife. The mirror broke, but the knife blades got chipped in the process. Donut Country is not written. Oh, I, I, I actually, I actually, I played Donut Country before. It wasn't on stream, but I played it before. I think it's not even Donut Country. I think it's Donut County. If I, I think, let me check. Uh, but yeah, I think I have played that one, off stream. I played that one uh, before. Sorry, Zach. You know it? Yep, I know it. It's the one where uh, basically like there's like this delivery app that like sends a hole that has this hole and you have to like suck things in and then you end up like basically the whole town gets sucked in. Into the hole. And then at the end you're trying to like get out of it. it looks like I can pass through the mirror. The sound of an organ. I can hear it coming from further back of here. Gotta keep going. This is... Ugh. What's with this sweet scent? A drone at the end of it, yeah, yeah. There's like a drone at the end of it, and you can see like what all the characters are doing at that moment in the credits. Do you not think that it is God's will to determine which shall come to pass? Should the will of God differ from your own, then what will you do? There is no God in this world. No. No, no, stop it. I want Zack to kill me. I don't want him to die. But if God doesn't acknowledge me, or if he doesn't exist, then what am I supposed to... Nope. Now is not the time to think of such things. At any rate, I gotta hurry and get the medicine. Gotta get the medicine. God desires the pure and sincere, and hence sac sacrifice an angel. Hello. Meet again, Dracula. Why do you return alone, Rachel Gardner? And what became of Zack? Did you leave him behind? No, Zack can't move. So I came here looking for some medicine to treat his wounds. I know that Dr. Danny came to this floor and, ha and has medicine. That's why. So in a while, I just... I, I swear to fucking God. I need a drink. I'll be right back. Hold on.
Wow. Back. I know that Dr. Danny came to this floor and uh, and has medicine, that's why. Oh, Danny, is it? That man is on a rampage is on a rampage of mindless self indulgence. I'm not saying it to you, I'm saying it to me because it's one of my favorite games. Yeah, but you've been kind of spamming it all over the chat and I'm tired of seeing it. <laughs> Can you at least like say it to yourself, like in your head? I truly wonder when his downward spiral began. I come to think of it. Danny is the one who brought thee here. Sorry, it's fine. Speechless, are we? Never mind that, there is no medicine here. Where did Danny go with the medicine? It appears Danny is not himself. He briefly revealed himself to me. Though, his current whereabouts, only God knows. Although, he, ha he has let his selfishness get the best of him. I took several vials of medicine from him. Then you know where I can find some. Indeed. Please let me have it. Do you really think it can be obtained so easily, Ray Churigadna? You would point that chip knife to Zach's knife of Zach's at me with trembling hands? How did you know this was Zach's knife? Another character from uh from Donut Con County? Alright. Oh I know. Oh I know. It was I who brought him here. Though look at him. His body is a battered, tattered, bloody mess. And thou hast deceived him, foul demon. Which no. This is Rachel, what hast thou done to them? Danny was a smart and sensible man, which is exactly why he knew this place like the back of his hand and refrained from self-indulgent conduct. What about Isaac? He is quite simple, to rephrase it, quite pure. And now he is treated horribly, greatly suffering to grant your wish to die by his hand. Wouldn't you agree that all this transpired since your encounter? I haven't done anything. You are an enigma, Rachel. Just who are you? Not willing to answer? Let me remind you that you stand before God. Uh-huh. Just as I suspect <laughs> just as I suspected you have no true faith in God. No. I believe in following the words of God. Then why is that? Why do you feel that way? It's not that you will not answer. It's that you cannot answer, correct? Your heart is smeared by deceit, simply by virtue of the belief that God has chosen you. And you are a witch who means to deceive my angels. No. Well then, you shall be put on trial. What the fuck that say? God desires the pure. And you are charged with being a witch who has deceived my angels. In any case, you must be cleansed. I'm not a witch. Nay, you are a witch who, are, who forged a pact with Isaac, are you not? My promise with Zack 
is sworn is a sworn oath to God. <laughs> you would even dare to use God as your shield. Then let me emphasize what you need not forget. This is your choice to make, but this is not your choice to make, but that of God's. Now shall we contest thee? Let the tri trial commence. Is anyone present to testify against this person? There sure is right here. Hello all. I'm your witness. I'll testify why this wonderful sinner is such a cruel, heartless woman. Hold it. Don't leave me out. <laughs> I could testify all day about what makes Rachel so lovely. But knowing how stubborn she is, I'm more in the mood to humiliate her. I'm the only one... I'm the only one who can testify for who she really is. Ah, Rachel. Best assured as I am here in your corner. I'm here to defend you, remember? I'm on your side. <laughs> hmm. A testimonial... Triumph... Tri triumvirate of whatever the fuck that means. Very well. Each shall take a turn giving a testimony. Now who shall go first? Me. Me. Reve oh, fuck off. Pick me to go first. No, that's not fair, Kathy. I called firsties. No offense, Eddie, but that's just not gonna happen. I'm first in line. Oh, why? You didn't even give a reason. The biggest victim of this woman's villainy is moi. Unlike you creeps, I didn't become sickly infatuated with her from the start. Oh god, why you gotta be so hysterical all the time? That's quite a mouth you have, Kathy. I look forward to your testimony. Make haste. I grow impatient. Have we witness have the witnesses reached a decision yet? Yes, re reverend, whatever the fuck that means. I'll be going first. Oh man, you always get you always gotta get your way. Alright, Eddie, let's take our leave for now. You may begin your testimony, Kasarin Wado. I got this in the bag. Listen well, ladies and gentlemen. This demon may not may look innocent and gent may look like an innocent gentlewoman on the outside. But her heart is as black as charcoal. A bona fide witch. I'm not. Case in point, she lies through her teeth. A common collective pathological liar. Hmm. Is there any evidence in thine testimony to prove Rachel's a witch? Yes, like you wouldn't believe. I would... I was cast down from my position as a condemn as a condemner by her malicious hand. There I was, sitting high and mighty, watching the torture unfold. Then Zack proceeded to slash himself because this woman told him something. One could say that Isaac Foster's stature as a sinner was also crippled by his meddling wo by this meddling woman. One of the beer bottles. I was wondering what that clinging was. The whole display was so pathetic that it made me furious. I ventured down to meet them head on. 
Then what do you think this woman does without batting an eyelash? She shoots me. A condemner, a condemner outfoxed and shot by a sinner. That's not something that should ever happen. That woman's nothing but a wily wolf in the sinful sheep clothing. I mean, how could she uh, cast me down to such a horrid place? Only a demon could do such a thing. Not really. I have no memory of intentionally outfoxing you or destroying your reputation. You did too destroy it, you demon. And do you have any idea of what hurts most of all? She enjoyed shooting me. There's no ifs and no ands or buts about it. This is a witch we're dealing with. I vote for water torture. <laughs> I want to see you struggle and squirm. Give me a rush of excitement. And even surpass that even surpassed us last time. Do you want to see it that badly? Huh? Do you truly want that to happen to me? I've heard enough. Play if found, please. Oh my fucking god. What is it? Uh, let me see. If found. Wait, this actually looks like a pretty cool game. It's a visual novel. You know, I also, you know, need to use money for food, but okay, sure. Reverend, we still haven't sentenced her yet. You are not the sentencer, Catherine Ward. Besides, what do you seek from someone who you deem to be a witch? That will be all. Moving on, I call the next wit witness. Say your testimony against her. Yippee, it's finally my turn. This is why I hate kids. You guys are also self-centered. Try to have a little compassion. Right, Rachel? Edward Mason, you are capable of testifying against this person. Yep, Reverend, I sure am. I'll go over the good and the bad about her. Green Cactus? What the fuck is Green Cactus? Are you calling me Green Cactus? Then begin. Uh, Rachel's such a cutie. Her voice is like a songbird's... My favorite type of voice. That, and she's kind of like me. We're also close in age as well. The game, uh... Plus, the way she knows exactly what she wants and goes for it. Is exactly why I should have met you earlier, Rachel. I uh, knew who you were, but the reason I fell for you was uh, 
because I knew you were a lot like me. Rachel, I know what you did. It was you who buried the bird on B6, right? Yes. That's why I was convinced we'd have chemistry. Not to mention that you spoke of wanting to die, the perfect wish for me. But Rachel, you got a bit stubborn, didn't you? Didn't listen to anything I had to say. Tried so hard to charm my way into your heart in so many ways. Everything, everything was for you, Rachel. But it was no use. Even though you never accepted my advances, I held out in hopes that you'd eventually say yes. I even came to sweep you off your feet in total darkness too. After all, guess what happened to me? I was slashed by Zack and was left all by my lonesome in the grave. I like graves and all, but that wasn't the ending I desired at all. But that's where I finally realized the biggest thing that sets us apart. I really wanted Rachel. Everything I did was for her. But Rachel was different. Rachel did everything for herself and herself only. How mean. You meanie. Her sugary whispers about wanting to be killed were all for the sake of... were only for her sake only. How truly self-centered and selfish. And stubborn. Oh so stubborn. I also have no clue why you'd pick Zack over me. That is probably just Rachel being selfish again. She knows... She shows no regard for anyone's happiness. And that got me thinking. Isn't all of that something that a witch would do? Right? Don't you think so, Rachel? That's why I vote that. Rachel be sentenced to hang in a spike-laden pit of death. Straight down the pit she'll go, and only when I... And only then will I make her happy. What? Are you angry? S sorry, but it's all your fault. Talk to me. Don't ignore me. Enough. What? Alright. Oh, uh, but wait. Rachel hasn't answered me about anything yet. Oops. You are being misguided by the likes of a witch, Edward Mason. A witch can see right through a heart that embraces her and fears her. Ugh. My voice is starting to give in. That will be all. An unyielding witch you are. I'm not a witch. Moving on, I call the next witness. State thine testimony against her. Are the ridiculous testimonies over now? Hey, yeah, Rachel. You seem at ease, no? Are you relieved I'm here? Daniel Dickens. You're willing to testify? Yes, of course, Rev Reverend. I mean, somebody's gonna do a decent job of testifying, Rachel. Is it okay if I can say something? At this point, yeah, sure. Fuck it, go ahead. I must be the one to sing Rachel's praises. 
Hey Rachel, you know I'd never misunderstand you, right? Then begin. To be truthful, it's ridiculous to testify about something so plain as the light of day. That's how much everyone misunderstands, Rachel. It all started in the therapy room where I, f where I first met her. At the time, I was looking for the perfect pair of eyes. Living eyes forever frozen in death. Naturally, even dead eyes would do. But they're all cloud. But they get all cloudy. But it was not meant to be. After all, an average Joe's eyes change immediately depending on their emotional state. Despair to hope. Disappointment to malice. Well, it comes with my profession. At the time, I was in charge of counseling her. Looking back on it now, it makes me so happy. Never have I seen such magnificent, such fascinating eyes. Such blue, murky, and tranquil lakes among darkness. Enough to steal my heart. So when I stay green cactus, but to be honest, didn't say it to you. I saw it from. I know, I know, I know. You said it already. You d you don't need to repeat it. I I know. You said the game. That's good. All right. I'll see what it is. I don't know the game. All right. Such blue, murky, and tranquil lakes among darkness, enough to steal my heart. Then, during one of my sessions with her, the most obvious thing occurred to me. Her eyes were the very ones I sought, alive and forever frozen in death. I mean, there's no arguing that her heart is just, just odd. A pitiful, helpless soul. Daniel Dickens Is what I say not true? Daniel There's no way her soul could ever be saved Danny I mean it's because It's because her soul Stop it Her soul can't be saved I mean because her soul consumes others without mercy or remorse. A soul that buries and steals anything it can. Hmm? What's wrong, Rachel? Oh, what lovely eyes you have. May I look at them? Oh, and when we were reunited on B5, she was acting a bit strange. Even now, she seems off, though. Now look. Wait, look now. You're almost back at, to your old self. Everything will be alright as long as I'm here. Why don't we get through this together? Daniel Dickens. Sorry. Is that your testimony? I could go in more detail if, about what makes her so wonderful if you'd like. No need for that. I think I've heard more than enough. Not to mention, your testimony was rather condemn, condemning, con condemning. Witness, you may now leave. It will be alright, Rachel. You heard me, right? I said the real you shouldn't have its soul stolen. Hmm. <sighs> Your sentence has been determined. You two heard the claims by each of them. 
Danny's was especially telling. He is the most in tune with your background. It was certainly Danny who watched over you the longest. And it was Danny who bore witness to the truth and never refuted you. Then I'm gonna stop spamming it. Alright. Um, yeah, go ahead. Um... He is no doubt infatuated with your sorceress. None of that is my fault. Dr. Dan is just being selfish. No, he's being creepy, but okay. Have you ever considered that you are the selfish one, Rachel Gardner? Eddie said... Eddie said so in his testimony. About how you neglect everything besides your own ambition. And then there's Kathy. What an unfortunate soul. On top of tricking her, you go as far as to entrance in transfer in your spell. To see a woman of pride like her reduced to an empty shell of her former self. How appalling. You are a witch. No. Am I wrong? You are unable to even refute a single claim made against thee. Well, witch. Let thee be cleansed. Now, the witch shall be burnt at the stake. I'm not a witch. Who would believe words spilling from the, from the mouth of a witch? No. Even after hearing the testimonies, you remain steadfast in your claim. You murdered their hearts. Yes, you murdered their angelic hearts. You played them like violins and left them for dead. What a fat, what a barbaric feat. And now, you plan to pull the same stunt, even with, even with Isaac Foster, am I right? Yes, another sacrifice for your selfish ambition. Stop it, you're wrong. Now. It's hot. So hot. Admit you are a witch. Reveal thyself to us. And let the sacred flame sanctify thyself to God. I'm not a witch. Besides, nothing like this is written in the Bible. But of course, Rachel God, no. That's because your so-called God doesn't exist. But you've been using the name of God this whole time. Yes, because I'm referring to my God. What? I am a servant of God. You might call me... The god of this place. So you mean that you're god? Why yes, here I am the closest to being god. I don't believe you. I don't believe you. I won't believe you. A faithful heart is the significance of God's existence, my poor dear Rachel. And never... You never had that from the start. It can't be. It simply can't be. That doesn't exist. How? 
That just can't be. I won't accept it. I can't accept that. That preacher insisted that he is God. But that can't be. He's wrong. I don't wish to be killed by that God. But my God doesn't exist. so cold. It's so hot yet something cold is in my hands. This... What's this? Ah, what was it again? Something. Something precious to me. Something that I broke and ruined. Yep protected me this whole time. Wait, I'll try to remember. Ah! Zuck's knife. Oh, I can move. Finally, a chip knife is thrust, in, is thrust into the floor. It's cold. It hurts. It's chipped, yet cut so well. Uh, well now, my god. Well now, my god is here after all. Have you awoken? The strange things I've seen on this floor were, were all illusions. It's what you've shown to my heart. My God has opened my eyes. Then, I wasn't able to purge the witch with Indy? I'm not a witch. I've not made any... Um, Covenants. Just say contract. There was an oath. It was an oath from my god. Rainbow by the wall? I think that's like the colored glass. I see. The witch in you has chosen to perceive perceive it that way. Even if you're mistaken, even if what you say is a fabrication of lies, you do not care it seems. None of that matters. Hurry and give me that medicine. Oh pitiful witch who does not love anything but thyself. Follow me. Oh, finally that music <laughs> went down a little bit. This further in the back. After you. Why? Well, Zach's asleep and I don't know what you'll do. I see. There's a medicine... ...on, uh... ...hither shelf. The fuck? Talk like a normal person, god damn it. The shelf is lined with drugs such as... ...antiseptic solution... ...hemostatic agents... ...and... Hematinix Required medicine. This should definitely make him better. I'll go back to Zack. Thank you. 
I'm going back to Zack. Wait. You do not intend to kill me? Why would I? You now believe in a new god. Does thou not? In existence of multiple gods. The existence of multiple gods will cause nothing but trouble. Besides. You are not one to be merciful. Do you stand in my way? If not. Then there's no need for me to do so. I mean, I have no use for you. I see. Then I shall offer you the last piece of advice. Being known as God despises liars and the impure. That is, if your so-called God should actually exist. Rachel Gardner. It will all catch up with you soon. I got the medicine. Time to go back to Zack. There's a door here. I had a feeling it was an illusion. Tuck. Good, he's just asleep. The least I can do is apply the medicine first. I guess this is a... Uh, I guess this is the kind applied externally. His wounds are serious. But the bleeding's mostly stopped. And then... I just apply it and bandage him. The burn scars were originally there. Huh? Zack, are you awake? What the hell are you doing? I brought some medicine, so I was applying it to you. So you made it back, alright? Yep. Yep. You're all beat up. Was Danny there? How'd you get the medicine? Dr. Danny wasn't there. But I got the medicine from the priest on this floor. Oh, that guy. Ah, uh, hold still. Ugh, my wounds will probably open back up like this. I'll sit you up. I'm not half bad at suing. Back off, I'll do it myself. Are you good at suing too, Zach? I knew it. I'll take care of it. And I want to stitch up your stomach. Fine, whatever. Don't bitch to me if it gets gross. We're here. I'll cut the thread. Your hands are all beat up. Yeah, but it's alright. It doesn't hurt. Man, you're some piece of work. Look at you all calm, touching my fucked up stomach. Kudos for getting the medicine and coming back alive for in a weak state, but still. You don't gotta do this too. Hey Ray, why are you doing all this for me? Hey, can I use your knife to cut the thread? This knife cuts like a dream. Hey, quit playing dumb and answer me. Answer me. After all, Zack, you're my god. What? What kind of shit are you talking about? Hey, my knife. It's a bit chipped. I'm really sorry about that. Huh? What the hell's wrong with you? But I guess it's okay. Still, this knife is razor sharp. And really helped me out. Sorry, I'm sorry. I really appreciate it, though. It's a 
about time I stitch up those wounds of yours. Hold still for a second, Zuck. Ow! Hey, stop it! Shit! That hurts, you dumb fuck. Does it hurt? Hell yes, it does. I figured you wouldn't feel a thing. Man, you're as dumb as they come. Not some pain-loving masochist. For fuck's sake. Your god commands you to do a good job. You got it. Hey, suck. What is it now? Do these burns not hurt? Huh? Nah, not really. Not anymore, they don't. Oh. Okay. I'll get back to stitching then. When you're done, let's head out. Let's head out right away. Okay. Oh, and do something about your own wounds. What? Not only your hands, but your legs could use some attention too. If you can't run or something, when we gotta move fast, then we're fucked. Alright. I'll borrow some of your bandages if you have any to spare. That works. Okay, what's the plan? Seven found the elevator that takes us up to the next floor. Plus, we gotta pass through the area where the snakes are to get back to the elevator that takes us down. I suppose we hasn't. Yeah, I suppose we haven't checked the back of the room where Zach's medicine was. What a huge goddamn church! Hey. You know that preacher you talked about? Where is he? I don't know. You don't know? I'm surprised he gave you that medicine. It wasn't easy. Didn't think so. That man. I think he may have a soft spot for you, Zach. Please spare me the throw up. Shut it, then quit saying gross shit. There it is. The elevator isn't functioning. It appears to be a lever for setting it up the elevator. Pull the lever. This should work. So next is B1, hey? Alright, let's move. Ah, wait. Hey, Zuck. Mind if I ask you something? Can you ask me something? Just spit it out already. Okay. What is the story with your burns? What would you gain from knowing that? Nothing in particular. I was just curious about... You as all. If you're expecting a grip and tail, then look elsewhere. Nah. I'm not expecting some sort of epic story or anything. When I was a kid, some guy in my house set me on fire. A man set you on fire? Well, the whole thing kind of, well, the whole thing's kind of vague in my mind. It was probably a man who came to see the woman that gave birth to me. 
I see Kara live now. Oh, hold on. I'm, I mean, I'm almost done with the game. I kind of want to... Oh my god, she's doing a shiny only run. I want to see that so badly. <laughs> I think that's going to make me want to do my shot. My, my, I think that's going to make me want to continue my shiny only run. Hold up. <laughs> Uh, I'll, I'll finish this. This should be the last part of the game anyway, so... Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll go watch her after... After I finish this. I'm gonna take a break regardless, so... Yeah. Well, the whole thing's kind of big in my mind. He was probably a man who came to see that woman that gave birth to me. All I can really remember about the man is... Biting him and taking a chunk of his flesh. That's it. That asshole was bent on ending my life, but luckily, I was a resilient little bastard. Maybe she shit his pants. In the end, that woman wrapped me in cloth. Then she threw money at some shitty home and left me there. I see. That's pretty much it. You happy now? Yeah. What the fuck, you liked it? No, not really. Huh? But I did learn... But I did learn about your burns, so I'm happy. I don't know why. I just wanted to know about you, Zach. I think she's doing Pokemon uh, Riff. Oh, she's doing uh, Pokemon with Riff. I I'm okay with that. So I'm glad I asked. God, imagine if she's doing like another soul link. How bad is this gonna end up? <laughs> Are you shitting me? Nope. Really? Yeah. Then... I'm glad, you know? Yeah. And one more thing. You're not done yet? Do you still want to escape this place? Huh? What the hell do you think? To think I'd be risking my life like this if I didn't. I see. Never mind then. What a screwy bitch. I'm gonna put this out. Uh, what a screwy bitch. I'm gonna put this out there f for you. Not a single word coming out of my mouth is a lie. A lie. Zack, I, uh, to be honest, I... What? Come on, spit it out. I... Never mind. What? What the hell is that? I'm sorry. I knew what I wanted to say, but it sort of slipped my mind. Get yourself together. There's one more floor to go. Drop the crack pike. Are you friends with Kara? I'm not particularly friends with her. At least not like on like a not even like on a like a VTuber level. Like. We have never really talked, really, but I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind being friends with her. Get yourself together. There's still one floor to go. Drop the crack pipe. <laughs> All right, just a little further and we're out of here. Let's go. Okay. I can't. I just can't tell him. I mean, Zack absolutely ab abhors liars, and God despises the impure. If he should ever find out that I've been hiding my sinful past all this time, he'll hate me for sure. I can no longer tell Zack the truth.
Uh -oh. What's this place? Inside of a house? Look at the blood trails. The being known as God despises liar and the impure. Ah, uh, oh no. It was here. I remember now. This is where I was. It leads the way. Wait, Zuck! Wait! No, I beg of you, don't go! Don't look in that room. There we go. That was the end of episode 3. What a cliffhanger. I mean, I know what happens because I've seen the anime, but... Damn. Imagine having to wait for this. Music is literally by Dova Sidra, which is free to use. <laughs> My fucking BGM is used by Do is made by Dova Sidra. <laughs> to be continued. Da, 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 da. I already made that joke. To be continued. Okay, now I'm gonna take a break and honestly I think I think I'm actually gonna I think I'm gonna take the the BRB gonna watch someone more fun screen. <laughs>